Ah, a little behind the scenes what just happened. Mark and Whitney were reading and I thought they were gonna come on camera and I'm right behind them. And so I hit the deck and then I had to get up and dust off my suit because I embarrassed myself. Isolated thunderstorms today, it's sunny through Easter weekend and those temperatures just keep rising. When it comes to the thunderstorms, a little bit of activity in North Idaho. We've got a cell just south of the South Hill. That's moving its way through. I think we're gonna hear a couple of rumbles of thunder here. A little bit of light rain coming out of it. Looks like that moves through, moves into Idaho and dies down. A few cells over Pullman, Moscow, down across the Palouse, out in central Washington. Those dissipate overnight and by tomorrow, it's just mostly cloudy. We'll get a few isolated, very light showers tomorrow afternoon and morning. It's just very isolated, very light. The big story here is just how cloudy it's going to be and how we're going to turn the corner to a warm and sunny weekend. Saturday, looking fantastic. Sunday, even better. High up near 60 degrees. Overnight lows are going to be quite chilly and keep in mind, coldest time of the entire day that hour after the sun comes up. So the mornings cold, the afternoons warm. Dress in layers. I'm supposed to tell you stuff like that, but here we are. Overall, it's that storm off the coast that threw us that energy. As that dives down to California, we nose in a ridge of high pressure, and that's what takes us into next week. All sorts of sunny, warm, and very, very dry. The overall weather pattern looks to kind of stay that way, but are we going to stay that way for a very long time? Ah, eventually we got to get another round of rain and eventually we got to get another round of cold, but it does look like that first week of April winds up delivering sunshine, warm temperatures, and both of those in a big way. We are once again up near 70 degrees by next Tuesday. And I don't know if you remember this from the last time we were up near 70. On average, our first day of doing that, all the way on April 18th. So we're still well ahead of schedule.